Hey guys, welcome back to Fake Card Friday. So today we are looking at this interesting Ixie monster called Antimatter Synchron. So Synchron, you, in his name, you probably know what it's probably going to be doing, so let's go over it. So, it is a light, rank 3, machine XYZ effect, 1800 attack, 1000 defense. It is made with two level 3 monsters. Its effect reads, once per turn, during either player's turn, you can attach one XC material from this card, then target one face-up monster on the field. Treat it as a tuner monster until the end phase. When this card is destroyed, draw a card. Alright, so it's pretty much a XC monster that makes monsters into tuners. I mean, essentially, that's the gist of it. Of course, it got that little bonus effect where you get to draw a card, so then, you know, instead of neg one, neg one for XCs, because XCs are naturally neg one if you're going to a two material XC, uh, you get to draw a card, so you pretty much get your card back. It's kind of like, has like a, a paladino you know, where it kind of just gives you your card back, you know, because you take two monsters to make this one monster, so it's a neg one, but then when this card is destroyed, you get to draw a card, so you zero out. Uh, the thing that I want to talk about with this is that it says you can target one face-up monster on the field. That includes itself. So you can turn this card into a tuner, an XYZ tuner, but because XC monsters are ranks and not levels, there's really not much you can do with this card. And, you know, it would definitely bring up a debate on, you know, what could you do with it? Would it be like a level zero tuner or, you know, what would it be considered? Because, uh you know, you wouldn't even know, because, you know, these are, aren't level zero, they just straight up don't have a level. So, therefore, uh, you wouldn't even be able to use this card. Uh, the thing with it is, is that it is a generic uh, rank three, so uh, if you have a different monster on the field or other monster on the field, you can go tour guide someone, tour guide, make this, and then make something else a tuner. But it's pretty much going to have to require a deck to not only be able to run exceeds and to specifically go into a rank threes, but also be able to synchro as well. Also, the monster that you're turning into a tuner may not necessarily be the card that you uh, want to be the tuner with, and um, some odd reason you can do it during either player's turn, as if you know during this during your opponent's turn, be able to turn one of your your monsters into a tuner is going to allow you to synchro summon during your opponent's turn, or you can also turn one of your opponent's monsters into a tuner if you want to do that. Overall, I really don't find this card that interesting. Uh, the creator said that this card can be useful in a number of ways. It can turn one of your synchro monsters into a tuner for shooting Quasar Dragon. Oh, I never thought about that. It can turn a lone non-tuner monster on your opponent's side of the field into a tuner to prevent a synchro summon. Oh, that is also good. That is also good, but uh, it's kind of situational. It also grants card advantage like most synchros do. Okay. So... Pretty much, if your opponent has a tuner and a non-tuner before they go into synchro summon, and keep in mind that you're gonna have to respond to it as soon as one of the monsters is summoned, because synchro summoning doesn't create a chain, so it can't be like, oh, before you synchro summon, I'm gonna use my effect. Now it's gonna be like, oh, I summon this monster. Is that okay? I summon this monster. Is that okay? If you say it's that that's okay with that monster being summoned, you can't, you know, do it whenever. You know, there's actually points in the game where you can respond to your opponent's plays. So. Pretty much, act, after you say, that's fun, you can summon your monster. You can't be like, oh, before you synchro summon, you know, turn that into a turn. You can't do that. So, you'd have to do it as soon as uh, it's time to respond. You can go ahead and, if they have a tuner and non-tuner, you can go ahead and detach, turn the other monster into a tuner, so they'll have double tuners. And, of course, you can't synchro with double tuners. So, uh, that's not a bad play. You can also turn one of your synchro monsters into a tuner to go ahead and go into a quasar, which I believe is one one tuner synchro monster and two non-tuner synchro monsters so still that's still a lot to make especially you know because their level still had to add up to 12 but uh it's, it's not a bad card it's not it's not i wouldn't say it's completely terrible i'd say it'd be not even played it, I, I could see this card being like a common in a set and no one would play it you know so tell me what you guys think of this card um I hope you guys enjoyed this Fake Card Friday. Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. And I will see you guys next Friday with another Fake Card that we'll be analyzing. Thanks for watching.